Hey everyone, and thanks for logging on to WXYZ.com. I'm 7 First Alert Meteorologist Mike Taylor, and we'll continue to track an opportunity for some frost that's going to move in. So widespread frost uh, leads to a cooler night and also a cooler morning for your Tuesday. And we're expecting numbers to go back into the 30s. So it is, it is going to be a chilly note. We'll need to layer up once again, but the uh, we should warm up fairly quickly into the afternoon. So your Tuesday afternoon, even though we start off in the 30s, we could actually finish off reaching the 60s. This will all come before an opportunity for some rain moves in. This will be Tuesday afternoon going into Tuesday evening when showers, or at least the chance of some showers, will move in. Uh, the opportunity for rain only picks up as we get closer towards midnight. I'm thinking the bulk of this is going to fall between Tuesday night and Wednesday morning. Then after that, we'll begin to lose the thread of the heavy rain. And then a few scattered showers, not going to rule that out through the middle of the day. Uh, but it will be a raw day on Wednesday. The clouds will be there. The opportunity for rain and the winds will pick up significantly. It's going to be a breezy day with wind gusts up to 35 miles per hour or more. So, uh, yeah, some rough weather is going to move in. 38 degrees for tonight. Clear and chilly. Frost advisory in effect. Once again, that's for the city. Some of the surrounding areas and backyards, you're going to have numbers into the low 30s potentially. We bounce back, though. 61 degrees for Tuesday. Now, some morning sun will give way to some rain in the afternoon as well as the evening. Numbers will once again recover once we hit Friday and to the, into the weekend with highs climbing near 70 degrees on Sunday. But as you can see, another round of rain is expected for Sunday going into Monday. And thanks for joining us here at WXYZ.com to get your forecast information. Next planned update will be by Kevin for your Tuesday morning.